Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Smart Trader. This is Dias Paul, and thank you so much for all your likes, comments, share, and subscribe to my channel. If you're a newer, definitely go to our channel, watch all the videos, and if you're liking these type of videos, then definitely you can hit the subscribe button for more learning videos. For the ones who wants additional services, only WhatsApp seven eight nine two six five two four eight one. And for the ones who wants to be part of my secret Telegram channel, open your account quickly in Zeroda or Upstock or Angel Broking, and you'll be part of my secret Telegram channel only for learning, not for recommendations. So without wasting time, let's start off with today's live trading session. Hi Dash, I am Setu from Tamil Nadu. I am a big fan. First of all, I am wishing you for third year anniversary. I thank you for your way of teaching, technical analysis and live trading with your videos. Uh, second point is, you are looking so smart and young and healthy. The third point is mm, you are foreign driven because life enjoying life is more important than earning money. Thanks. Keep going. So I just taken a position in this particular uh, one first I took two quantities and then two lots sorry and then one more lot I just took in this particular trade. Uh, so the average is around 421.32 Point three will be one rupee twenty paisa somewhere. So almost uh, four twenty two point five zero, which it went a close bit. But by then I went to buy one more lot. Okay, market market is negative. If you see market is negative, let me just apply a candlestick. So market has opened gap down if you see and it has not broken the range it is going sideways same thing we were discussing in the telegram secret telegram channel that the market is gap down and then it is going a bit sideways so we need to take advantage accordingly because until and unless market breaks out the above level or below level that direction is not having much advantage but considering market is down and market is gonna you know recover a little bit up because it is in the lower levels you see this little bit of recovery during that time stock will get a little bit of advantage like this so as soon as the stock has some uh, spike up little like this we can book a profit and take out the profits yes the stock is a negative stock but the stock was recovering from the low uh, if you see it had hit an rsi of down and then it was going up i know it is almost reaching the peak now so 423.30 is the high as of now next resistance is somewhere around 425 somewhere close to 425 then it is 430 like that so on so now i um, just want to see if it can go up to that level or else has this reached now when the equity has not reached even the futures have not yet reached that point so if this can go up to 425 then yes it's an advantage for me or else 422.50 is a 0.3 percent looking at the market it is turning a bit red here now. A lot of fluctuations in the stock. All right, the, the stock went down from our levels. If you see, the stock went down up to these levels. So during that time, what did I do? I just added two more. Um, I tried to add um, one one lots, but it has got rejected. 
some reasons i don't know then i closed the app and reset it in my mobile and then uh, finally when it came to 418 that levels i took two more lots so that my average has come to 420.32 right so now my average has come down now uh, from here i can wait for 1 rupee 20 paisa that is 421.50 will be my target from here onwards so let's wait and watch for the stock to recover market has come down from those levels so it has uh, affected the stock but anyways we will wait for some more time so that stock will take a gain and then go up All right, uh, so I'm back from the gym and uh, the stock price is trading in the same area uh, from long time I guess uh, so I was watching my stock when I was in the gym also so I couldn't record but finally I'm back home oh it has gone to 21.50 okay so I missed that part anyways so I think the time is already 2 o'clock so any spike coming up from here because my buy price is around 2 420.32 so 421.50 is where I have to exit around. Um, if there is a good spike, then I can book it up. The volume also has reduced the candle size. Market has recovered a very, in a very good way. If you see from morning what we saw has almost come to these levels but the stock didn't have much impact directly to the market movement if you see the stock is going almost sideways can't say end of the day there will be sudden spikes also at the end of the day mm -hmm. you, you would have seen most of the time sudden spikes come and the stock goes up like anything but it can happen in both side also so we need to be very careful while judging that So finally I have executed the sell orders because I had too much of shares the 5000 shares so the stock had gone so almost I sold in this ratio uh, 421.80 421.65 and 421.20 because the stock was sliding down and the number of lots I had was more so obviously it will slide down when I hit exit so it went up to 422 so when I hit my first exit it came down down and then the stock came down gradually so I exited as soon as possible so we have booked more than uh, 0.5 uh, right almost average is more than 0.5 percent uh, we have booked on this particular trade that was the end of today's trade again market is falling down so I don't have any hopes the last hour it is falling the last almost hour so therefore I exited later on it can spike up or go down so I don't want to take risk whatever money is money and uh, anyways uh, thank you so much for watching this video it's a long video i guess so see you soon in my next video hit that subscribe till then take care bye bye